Okay. Um, disappointing loss for our football team. Um, felt our guys, felt our guys were going to play better than what we did. Uh, we missed a lot of opportunities out there. We left some plays out on the field, and um, we didn't we didn't make the winning plays when we had an opportunity to make them. And, and then we had some costly penalties, penalties that, that stalled some drives, shut some drives down, and, and it really cost our football team. You know, but I think all in all, we just we just couldn't play winning football. We didn't make those winning plays that we needed to make. How deflating was it to have a touchdown pass dropped and a long touchdown run called back from a momentum standpoint? I mean, it's, it's, it's so it was it was critical. I mean, I think we all know what momentum can do in the game of football, and, and that would be a wonderful for us. That would would have put us back up, you know, and, and um, we would continue to give our quarterback confidence and just our entire football team, you know. And uh, that's what I mean about making those winning plays. You know, our guys got to our guys still don't know how to win yet. You know, we got to continue to uh, find ways to. For those guys to make those winning plays, you know, so so we can win those ball games like that. The plays was there, you know, we didn't execute. After this, Willie, do you do you think your guys are close to playing winning football? I do, you know. Um, after this, and I, I tell you now, I'm, we're gonna have ourselves a good football team. You know, before it's all said and done, this football team is gonna be pretty good, and uh, we got this this, this bye week to to really uh, correct some things. I mean, as, as a staff, we gotta evaluate our roster, our talent that's out there. And, we got to make sure we put the right guys on the field. You know, guys that can make those winning plays that we're talking about. But guys aren't far. We just again making the winning plays. I mean, the plays were out there. We didn't we didn't execute. You know, at the bottom line, offensively we didn't execute. Defensively we didn't execute. We didn't play like we were capable of playing on defense as well. You know, there's too many guys going down the field freely. You know, mm -hmm. and that's not what we do on the defense side of the ball. So uh, just both sides of the ball from an execution standpoint, we didn't do a good job at all. Quinton. Um executes arguably his best drive of the season, then you go to Stephen Bench. What was behind that? Well, we told Stephen he was going to play in. And okay. we, we stuck to our word. And we've been telling him all year they both going to play, but we told Stephen he was going to play in, and, and we stuck to it. You weren't very productive in the passing game, getting the ball down the field. You were productive in the running game. In retrospect, do you think maybe you should have run the ball more? No, we, we was running the ball. We didn't do a good job of that early in the game. You know, we didn't sustain any drives. We were running the football then. Again, one guy here and there missed a block. I mean, that could have been a big play for us, and, and that, that slowed us down there in the first half. You know? But again, we, we threw the ball, we catch that long touchdown pass, and again, it's, it's a different ball game. So, um, then we had another drop for a pick, you know, uh, another drop for a touchdown down there to Ernest down that way. So, uh, we, the plays were there. We just got to execute. You know, we execute them. It's different ball game. We're, we're talking about something. receiver bubble screens that had been working for you in the first games that weren't as effective today. Was that something Maryland was doing differently? Or? Well, we didn't block well out there. When we decided to throw it, our receiver didn't do a good job of blocking it. And, and as soon as our receiver caught it, we just didn't tackle it. So that goes back to execution. You know, um, we just didn't block well when they were there. I mean, the, you know, the receivers dropped balls, but Rodney just, just took his eye off it. Did you have any kind of feel for what, what happened? I don't think he took his eye off it. I just, when you watch it, and I saw it on the Jumbo was trying to he just, he just wasn't running comfortable. Just like he was, I don't know, I don't know exactly what to call it, but he just didn't look comfortable as he was running up underneath the ball. You know, it was a nice thrown ball, dropped right in there, and should have been an easy throw and catch for us, man. Uh, those, those are winning plays that we talk about. We got to make those plays as a football team. We make those plays, momentum on our side, things change. Our football team needs that. It needs some good going for it. And good early. And we had an opportunity for it early to happen. Say they don't know how to win yet. How do you how do you learn how to win? Oh, game? first about making those silly penalties. You know, there's a lot of penalties that stop some drives. You know, we got a couple first down that came back because of penalties. You know, I think it started there first and foremost. And then making those winning plays. You can't drop a wide open pass. You know, uh, they threw the ball deep, caught it in school. That's that's winning football. You know, we can't we can't drop that. We, we can't drop a third down and then they pick it off and we have a first down. You know, those winning plays that our football teams. Guys just got to make them. You know, again, I said the plays was there. And, uh, and our guys will make them. You know, um, this was it's a bad game for us, man. But I think our guys will make them. They'll, they'll bounce back and uh, make those plays that we need to make. 
Sounds like uh, this bye week open competition for some jobs. Yeah, uh, like I said, we're going to evaluate it and, and, and make sure the right guys are in there. You know, mm -hmm. um, again, I think you can go through that the game and see some individuals that played really hard. You know, but I think you also go in there and see some individuals that made some big time mistakes for us. You know, things that we know day one we can't do. Mm -hmm. You know, and I saw that uh, quite a few out there. And we got to get better at that. You know, especially when there's older guys that make some of those mistakes. It just can't happen. So, check that. Check that. So, to be clear, the decision to switch quarterbacks was made before the touchdown before, drive? Yes. And what was before the, the game? Before the game. Yes. He was going to come in to start the fourth yes. quarter? Well, well, he was going to come in and start the second series okay. of that second half. And that was the second series. It actually just happened in the fourth quarter, not the third. And it was just to get both playing time, mm -hmm. not due to different abilities? No. Okay. 